Hey guys, today I'm doing something different. As a classical guitarist, you get the same annoying questions both online and in person by different people. So I decided to ask my friends if they'd like to participate in a five stupid questions classical guitarists get. So here they are. Can you play classical gas? Oh. Technically, yes, but I won't. Classical gas is not really part of the classical guitar repertoire. Us classical guitarists would rather learn miniatures by Francisco Tarrega, lute suites by Bach, sonatas by Scarlatti, or modern pieces by the great Cuban composer Leo Brauer over some late 60s instrumental pop. Second, classical gas isn't really good. Classical gas is usually played by crossover artists or country and folk artists like Doyle Dykes, Tommy Emanuel, or Glenn Campbell. So no, we won't be playing any classical gas. El otro día vi que tocaste lesionada. ¿Cómo te encuentras? Bueno, en realidad no toqué lesionada. Es que a veces los guitarristas tocamos con una especie de calcetín, manguito parecido a este y, y lo usamos para evitar que se nos quede pegado el brazo a la guitarra y bueno, desarrollar nuestra técnica. Eh, es una ayuda, es un complemento realmente eh, que nos favorece sobre todo en verano, pues eso, que, que el brazo pueda ir mejor, el brazo derecho. Pero, pero bueno, hay gente que, que me ha llegado a decir que, que estoy lesionada y que no se preocupen, que no estamos lesionados. Why don't you just play with a pick? That's a good question. So first of all, it is a lot harder to lose a finger than it is to lose a pick. And instead of having just one pick, you can have five fingers. Really four. Sometimes we use the pinky. All joking aside though, I feel like playing fingerstyle guitar, classical guitar, um, is really unique in the way that our body manipulates the guitar. That the slightest adjustments in angle and pressure completely changes the sound of the guitar. It's really special actually. And I just love it. I love being able to use my body to produce such a beautiful sound. Guitar is a beautiful instrument, it makes a beautiful sound, it has so much to offer, and I just can't imagine doing some of the things I can with a pick, in contrast to being able to do it with my fingers. It just seems impossible. I understand that a lot of other styles are able to do things that I can't do, for sure, like metal and, yeah, um, no, I can't do stuff like that. But some of the things that I do with my fingers, they can't do. So that is why I play with my fingers instead of a pick. Hey, you got tabs for that? Yeah, I actually do, except they pretty much tell you nothing. Now, the reason why for this is because guitar tabs pretty much only tell you how to play something, but not what you're playing and what it even means. Okay, so think of it like this. Imagine you're reading a book in a language that you don't understand, but you can say every word correctly. Good enough that even a native speaker can understand what you're saying. Except you as the reader doesn't leave knowing a whole lot about what you said and you didn't really learn anything from that. So can you get by with that? Yeah, I think somebody totally could. But the real question is, is that something that somebody should intentionally not learn if they're in the position to do so? You tell me. Hey, you're hot. Can I get your number? No, you cannot get my number. <sighs> okay, I guess uh, you look at me this way, fine. I can change your mind, neither the way you think or see things, that's fine. However, um, I don't think you should ask for my number because it's just not proper. You can follow me on Instagram my Instagram is Saira Menezes Guitar and you know, you can support my music and if you like my music and the work that I do, I totally will appreciate it. 
but if you call me hot just because you think I'm hot or um, whatever, no. And you definitely cannot ask for my number either. So go figure. Yeah, exactly. Don't ask for that again. Duh. What about you? What stupid questions do you get asked? Let me know in the comment section below.